Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. In this segment, we will study the role of liver, gallbladder, and pancreas in digestion. Starting with the role of liver in digestion. Liver is the largest gland of the body with an average weight of 1500 grams. It is the second largest organ after the skin in human body. It lies under the diaphragm within the rib cage. Liver is divided into two major lobes, the right lobe and the left lobe. Between the two lobes lie the falciform ligament. Falciform ligament attaches liver to the front body wall. Liver cells are called hepatocytes that secrete bile. When liver cells, that is hepatocyte, secrete bile, it is collected by hepatic ductules that eventually join together to form the right hepatic duct and the left hepatic duct. The right hepatic duct and the left hepatic duct join together to form the common hepatic duct. Gallbladder has the Cystic duct. Cystic duct from the gallbladder joins the common hepatic duct to form the common bile duct. Common bile duct is also called ductus coliodocus. Sphincter of Boyden surrounds the common bile duct. We know that sphincter refers to muscles that normally maintain constriction. From the pancreas arises the pancreatic duct. The common bile duct and the pancreatic duct join together to form hepatopancreatic duct. The hepatopancreatic duct receives bile from liver as well as pancreatic juice from pancreas. The hepatopancreatic duct also has a sphincter called sphincter of odi. Some people call it sphincter of OD. When sphincter of a dye opens, bile and pancreatic enzymes enter the duodenum. The point where hepatopancreatic duct opens into the duodenum is called major duodenal copula. Function of liver Liver manufactures 600 2000 ml of bile per day. Bile is composed of water, bile salt, bilirubin, and electrolytes like sodium, potassium, calcium, chloride ions, and bicarbonate ions. Bile is used in duodenum of small intestine for emulsification. Emulsification refers to the breakdown of fat globules into Tiny droplets so that enzymes can digest these tiny droplets into fatty acid and glycerol. So, bile helps to emulsify fats which are later on digested by enzymes. Bile also helps in the absorption of simple fats, cholesterol, phospholipids, and lipoproteins. When fats are digested, into fatty acid and glycerol. These fatty acids and glycerol are coated by bile salt forming micelles. Thus, micelles can be defined as lipid aggregates with a surface coat of bile salt. Micelles are very small and they can be easily crossed across the microvilli of the intestine. Thus, bile performs two functions. First, it helps in the emulsification of fats before their digestion and once fats are digested, the other role of bile is the absorption of these digested lipids in the form of micelles. Gallbladder. Gallbladder is a small pear-shaped hollow organ near the liver. In adults, Gallbladder mayor 
approximately 7 to 10 centimeter in length and 4 centimeter in diameter when fully distended. Gall bladder has three parts fundus, body, and neck. Fundus is the rounded base that faces the abdominal wall. Body lies in a depression below the right lobe of liver. Neck is the tapering end of the gall bladder. The neck leads to the cystic duct. Gall bladder stores 30 to 60 ml of bile produced by the liver. When food is eaten, the gall bladder contracts and releases stored bile to help break down of fat as we have already mentioned earlier. Role of pancreas in digestion. Pancreas is a G-shaped organ that lies beneath the stomach. It is 12 to 15 centimeter long and weighs about 100 grams. Pancreas has group of cells called pancreatic acini. These pancreatic acini secrete digestive enzymes. The pancreas is divided into four parts. Head, neck, body and tail. The pancreatic acini secrete enzymes that are collected by pancreatic duct. Pancreatic duct is also called the major pancreatic duct or the duct of Virson. We have already studied earlier that the pancreatic duct joins the common bile duct to form the hepatopancreatic duct. The hepatopancreatic duct has sphincter of a dye. When the sphincter of a dye opens, the pancreatic enzyme as well as bile are released into the duodenum at a point called major duodenal papilla. The pancreas also have accessory pancreatic duct or the duct of Santorini. The duct of Santorini open into the duodenum at a point called minor duodenal papilla. The pancreatic acidine secrete digestive enzymes that include trypsin, carboxypeptidase and chymotrypsin. These enzymes digest proteins into small peptides and amino acids. Pancreatic lipases that digest triglycerides into fatty acids and glycerol. Phospholipase which splits phospholipids into fatty acids. Cholesterol esterase that hydrolyze cholesterol esters and pancreatic amylase that breaks down polysaccharide into monosaccharide and disaccharide.